You know, when people say that money is the root of all evil, it really makes me think, couldn't you also just say money is the root of all happiness? Because in in the saying that money is the root of all evil, they're talking about like the higher ups or the corrupt business owners who like exploit the workers or something like that. And And the whole idea that it's like, you know, that power corrupts you basically. <clears throat> but I would argue you could say, you could argue against that just the same way you could argue against money is the root of all happiness because there are plenty of people who have been poor, like bottom of the barrel. And when they get money, they're able to change their whole family's lives. They are able to fulfill their purpose in life. It's, and they're completely happy just because they were able to work and get that money. So I think... Perhaps it is true that money is the root of all evil, but it's also the root of all happiness in in a sense that a lot of modern struggles revolve around the fact that you probably don't have money. I'm not saying that you can't be happy without money. That's also not true because you have like monks and shit who are like at peace with themselves. But what I'm saying is you are likely someone who if you did have money and you worked hard for that, you would be a lot happier with your life. Let's just face it, bro. So we need to spin this phrase around and start saying that money is the root of all happiness and start focusing on getting money. A lot of people use this this phrase as like a cope to make it seem like they don't need to get money. or Like, that's not true, bro. I mean, look at your situation. Maybe you were born into money. Nice. All right. Well, let's, let's put it this way. If you're born into money and maybe your life is good. Perfect. Awesome. What about your kids? Do you have the the knowledge to pass down to them on how to make money? Or or like what <laughs> how are they supposed to learn how to make money that you inherited? You inherited money. But how are they supposed to learn how, how to to make money themselves? Because you if you inherited money, you likely didn't learn how to make money. Maybe you did. That's perfect. Your parents were good. If you didn't, well then you got to learn. Cuz if you don't the money's going to run out eventually. And then your kids are going to be left without a clue on how to make money. And they just, I don't know why. Maybe it's ignorance. But people need to start thinking a little less selfishly about this, uh, this whole money thing. It's like, okay, making money is a lot about mindset, honestly. And it's, they say like most rich people, if they went broke, they would get rich again. Like, if you took everything away from them, they would be rich again. And it's true, because it, it was something that they built up themselves and were able to turn around their lives, and and they, they could replicate it. So, basically, moral of the story, look at this phrase, money is the root of all evil, a little differently. Flip it around, money is the root of all happiness for you. Peace.